I, the dissection that I worked on was the forearm and through to the elbow region. But what was interesting to me is I've been interested to find out about where it is that the antibrachial fascia, the brachial fascia, fascia lata, et cetera, like bind directly to the muscle. It's not always a gliding surface. And, and Carla Stecco has talked about this in her work of how, you've probably seen some of those images where the muscle fibers go directly into the fascial bag and not just the epimesium, but into that deep proper fascia. And I, I would love to know the map of exactly all of those areas. Well, I got to learn a lot about one of them. And one of them is right here. And it's so clear because the plastinarium doesn't even bother to try to separate it. And that's why they can't. It's not separatable. It's a very artificial cut because the muscles of the extensors, this is sort of twisted around, but the extensor digitorum that comes right through here, it does, I like to say that it has a ceiling, a wall, and a floor. And that ceiling, wall, and floor is made of the most glorious, silvery, tough tissue that you've ever seen. And the roof is the antibrachial fascia. It's not its own distinct epimesium. So, stability and strength and pulling on the whole fascial bag as opposed to pulling on the bone, all these things that we've been hearing, I really could see. So we decided to try to go inside and show it a little bit more. So we made slits and opened this up to be able to show where the floor and the walls and the ceiling of that are, removing again by picking the muscle tissue away. So by hollowing out the muscles, you get to see this sort of, um, I don't even know exactly how to describe it. I haven't thought about it. Yeah. It's sort of like little troughs, <laughs> you know, that are feeding this little star shape that comes out of the elbow. And, and all of them integrate and become completely connected as they, they, they migrate on through. But I think what we ended up with, if it positions the way that we hope it will, is really a different way and very different from this to kind of see how that, all, that structure works together. So that was a big learning for me, a big learning for me this past six months. So.